When you envision the American dream, what do you think of? Warm summer nights? Good times with your family? A place where everyone gets a chance to be a star? It's no surprise why baseball is the American pastime. It teaches sportsmanship and competition. Whole communities band together in support of their club. It's the game of your granddad. The game you grew up playing. After all, when a dad wants quality time with his son, there's no place like the diamond. Diamonds that span across the country. From the Aquasox in Washington State to the Fort Myers Miracle on the sunny coast of Florida, people are enjoying minor league baseball games in their own hometowns. Nearly three quarters of Americans live in a minor league market. That's 104 million fans with 104 million different stories. It's no wonder that advertisers are jumping on board because the minor league brand is also making its sponsors its star. With the diamond as their stage, these brands have a chance to connect with American families. We're talking about 45 million young families who call themselves Hops, Isotopes, and Thunder. We love the Pelicans! That means about half our audience has kids under 18. And when school's out, the minor league season is just starting to heat up. The promotions and donations are starting. The hot dogs are being grilled. First pitches are being thrown. Minor league fans know how to celebrate spring and own summertime. For as little as $60, a family of four can have an experience much more unique than a night out at the movies, complete with a meal and a touch of hometown flair. With ad campaigns as diverse as our fans, the MILB provides opportunity for advertisers on a local and national scale. One man very familiar with these ad strategies is the owner of the Pensacola Blue Wahoos, Quint Studer. If you can take your product and you position it with something that people feel good about, now people also feel good about your product. He stresses the importance of a sponsor's role in the community. They like organizations that they know take some of their dollars and benefit other people. A community revitalized in his town by the Wahoos new stadium. People in Pensacola lived on water, but there were very few access points to water. So I think having a, a park there, an open stadium there with access, really was able to get people back to the water. It's a place where friendships are forged and business deals take shape. You're literally connecting with everyone. Most business people have told me they've done more business at baseball games than they've ever done anywhere else because you just run into people and they're more relaxed. So now the field is set. The baselines have been drawn, the fans are in the seats, and it's the advertiser's turn to step up to the plate. What about you? Will you take the bat? <laughs>